I'm only going to talk for just a moment because uh, we've already received so much wonderful information. Uh, I'd like to start, uh, obviously, uh, with a little recognition that we are on the traditional land of the Blackfoot Confederacy, the Tsutsina Nation, the Nakota Nation, and the Métis Nation of Alberta Region 3. Thank you and congrats to all of the Emerald Awards team, the volunteers, and to this community, this amazing community of builders, innovators, sponsors, dignitaries, and all of you for helping create a new model of thinking. Sandstone, mudstone, coal, and shale. The alien landscape of the Drumheller Badlands captures the imagination. Photographs of its moonscape, its unearthly formation suggest an inscription, a mystery much larger than each of us, a message just out of reach. Gripped into the grasslands along the Red Deer River, it's as if another planet has taken up residence here, has found its place within the soil, caving in around us to reflect a new topography. Over millennia, these structures and forms, coolies, hoodoos, capstones, spires and pinnacles, fairy chimneys, towers and mushrooms, their names suggesting a new architecture, have created a cityscape of change. Striated in shadow, gray and azure, sliced through with sinews and muscles of sediment, these structures reflect an ancient newness, a wisdom beyond the moment. The Badlands suggests that there is another landscape beneath our feet, a surge of change and difference, a beauty in the way of thinking that tickles the edge of synapse, strokes our thinking. The innovative stewardship that we celebrate here at the Emerald Awards, it's just that. Fragile flashes of change and beauty which erupt and transform. These Emerald Awards and each of you work for change, work to imagine, work to invest and reinvest in a new landscape of thinking. You grip the province in your hands. You hold the earth. You seek a new beauty. Thank you all so very much.